Hello and welcome to our channel. Now in this video, we'll tell you how the cast of 1993's Frasier has changed. I'll show you what they looked like back then in 1993 and now in 2022 how they changed compared to when they were in the sitcom. Alright, let's go. Jane leaves in the sitcom she played Daphne Moon, a British immigrant from Manchester. In 1993, she was 32 years old and now she's 61 years old. Just little things I sense about people. I mean, it's not like I can pick the lottery. If I could, I wouldn't be talking to the likes of you two now, would I? <laughs> I'm talking about tears of joy, of course, because we perform again and again for the thrill of making something greater than ourselves. Kelsey Grammer in the sitcom he played Dr. Frazier Crane, a radio psychiatrist. In 1993, he was 38 years old and now he's 67 years old. Uh, where are you calling from? Home. Well, if any of Ethan's classmates are listening, <laughs> you know where he is, and he can't stay in there forever. A continuation of Frasier. Uh, it's a fun idea, and they're all, you know, they're, they're similar, but they're, it's right. a new life in a new city, yeah. that kind of thing is, is where we're headed. Perry Gilpin in the sitcom she played Ross Doyle, producer of Frasier's radio show. In 1993, she was 32 years old, and now she's 61 years old. I'm in the middle of cooking. I ask him to hand me the honey, and he gets this freaked out look on his face and says he can't because he has a deathly fear of touching anything sticky. <laughs> I thought it was a, a plane had accidentally gone in. Well, by the time the second one went, on, went in, things were dawning on everybody slowly, as we all remember. I, was, I think I was watching the Today Show. David Hyde Pierce in the sitcom she played Dr. Niles Crane, Frazier's younger brother. In 1993, he was 34 years old and now he's 63 years old. Frazier, I have a very sore head and a crackerjack lawyer, so don't crowd me. <laughs> Here, put this on it. Oh, thank you. Daphne, you've been wonderful in this time of crisis. No, that doesn't sound like Kelsey. But then I found the second definition. A person regarded as a representative symbol and for an example, they said this. Tom McGowan in the sitcom he played the role of Kenny Daly, KACL's station manager. In 1998, he was 39 years old, and now he's 63 years old. By the way, and you force my hand. That's our biggest sponsor. So unless you're willing to go in the air right now and read that ad, I have to fire you. Hi, I'm Tom McGowan and I'm pleased to be part of the Children's Museum of Manhattan's Storytime Saturday series. The book I'm reading today is one of my favorites. Johnny Mahoney in the sitcom he played Martin Crane, the father of Frazier and Niles, a straightforward and laid-back Seattle police detective. In 1993, he was 53 years old, and it was with great sadness that Mahoney died at the Chicago hospice on February 4th, 2018 from complications of a throat cancer. Age 77. <laughs> well, thanks a lot for all your help, boys, but I think we'll just split a bowl of cream corn, rub a little liniment into each other's joints, and fall asleep drooling on the couch. People in the audience to get from one side of the stage to the other. And, uh, but all that did was the energy that poured from the audience to you. Patrick Kerr in the sitcom he played Noel Shemsky. KACL's technical assistant and Star Trek fanatic. In 1994, he was 38 years old, and now he's 66 years old. I specially treated the back for easy wall adhesion. <laughs> that was very thoughtful of you, Noel. Well, um, I gotta run. I'll call you later. Mostly him, what you meeting who? Oh, yeah. Stories and stuff like that, a little bit. And, uh, it's been really loose, you know, everyone's sweet, it's been actually great. Edward Hibbert in the sitcom he played Gil Chesterson, a critic of KACL's luxury camp restaurant. In 1994, he was 39 years old, and now he's 67 years old. We thought Deb was your cat. She is not a cat. <laughs> She's Mrs. Gilbert Leslie Chesterton, a Sarah Lawrence graduate and the owner of a very successful auto body repair shop. Cause celebra. Yeah, yeah. about the Alma Rattenbury uh, murder trial. And uh, there were others such as that. So there was a, there's a, a lot of an, it's a English emotional reserve. Harriet Sampson Harris in the sitcom she played B.B. Glazer, Frazier's flirt and fake agent. 
In 1993, she was 38 years old, and now she's 67 years old. It's San Francisco. Do you know what life is like there for a good-looking straight man? <laughs> You'll be like a Snickers bar at a fat camp. <laughs> to do. Mm -hmm. um, and most writers don't get to do because they're so dedicated to, I'm going to act, and that's all I'm going to do. Millicent Martin in the sitcom she played Gertrude Moon, Daphne's mother. In 2000, she was 66 years old, and now she's 88 years old. To thank you, Donny, for rescuing my daughter from that horrible Dr. Crane. <laughs> well, Every time I call her, I'm not on the phone five minutes before that tyrant is ordering her to hang up. People make, giving herself food and driving us around. I, how they do it, their courage is amazing to have to go to work. Brian Clarkman in the sitcom he played Kirby, a part-timer at KACL and the son of Frazier's old classmate. In 2001, he was 26 years old and now he's 47 years old. That William Henry Harrison was a great man who was important because he was... President? No. We made the movie together and, uh, you know, I've been on sets my whole life, basically, and being behind the camera is something I've wanted to do forever. And it was like a, it was like a dream come true. It was so fun. Thanks for watching the whole video. If you like this video, please share it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to support us in producing the next video.